What's up guys, this is the Retro123 and today I'm bringing you a cool little glitch for MW3. Now before I get started, I want to tell you unfortunately I won't be able to show you in game because at the moment I don't have a recorder that will allow me to show you it. But today I'm going to show you an easy, the easy and simple way to get colored custom classes online. That's right, without mods you can go online with colored custom classes. Just a fun, cool little glitch. I enjoy it, it's good. It has a little spice and color to my gaming. Um... So I'm going to go ahead and get started. It shouldn't take that very very long. So uh, what I'm going to ask you to do is you need to go to CallDutyElite.com and you need to sign into your Elite account. I've already signed in because it takes a while to get in. Um, but if you don't have a Call of Duty Elite account, you need to make one. And then you're just going to sign up. And you, when you get up to this uh, career main page, that's where you want to be, career page. When you're here, you're just going to scroll down to your classes. Okay. Right here. Um... As you probably have noticed, some of my name, the names have interesting, um, have some interesting stuff behind them. Um, so what I'm going to show you is how to get colors. Um, the first thing you do is you want to click on your class, and then you want to click the arrow or the little pencil. And as you can see, it has these weird, um, these upside down V's, which is for on your keyboard. It should be Shift, um, Shift, and then. Uh, six, and that'll be the number that you have, and that'll be the V. Hold on, I'm just gonna delete this. Um, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna type that one. You're gonna type whatever color you want. So uh, I'll probably leave the colors in the description. But um, up, the up arrow in one is red, two is green, three is yellow, four is dark blue, five is light blue, six is pink, seven is black, and zero is normal white. So what you want to do is just want to type the number of what color you want, and then you're going to type in what you want to say. Now, as you saw before with all those different ones, I tried to use every color in the same one. Um, that will make your class completely blank. There won't be any name in the class at all, which I guess is kind of cool, but it's also kind of stupid. Um, I also, I haven't tried maybe just using one or two different colors. Um, if that works and you guys try it out, and if that works, um, leave a comment and let me know that works. Or I could probably, I'll probably just try it now. But as a reminder as to what those colors are, those colors are 1 is red, 2 is green, 3 is yellow, 4 is dark blue, 5 is light blue, 6 is pink, 7 is black, and 0 is white. So what you do, you type in what you want to say. Okay, so I just typed in colored. You know, actually, I'm going to do it. I'm going to go ahead and test this out. I'm going to do red and black, so that would be a 7. So, there. That's what, that, it'll look something like that. And I'm about to find out this works, okay? So when you have this, you have a color you want and everything like that. You just go down to select, let it load, let it do this thing. And if that's, if you only want to do class, one class, you, um... Or if you want to do all your classes, just go and change the names of all the classes you want to change, okay? When you have all that, all you do is send games, uh, send changes to game. You might want to send it one or more times, just in case. Cause some, uh, um, or maybe just go in and add another class and then send it again just to make sure. Um, so maybe just go into, let's say, the class I just made. Let's just go in and maybe um, click the ACR and click the AK and then go back on the ACR. Then click select, um, and then send the changes to game just in case. Um, when you set it one or more times, what you're going to do, now listen closely, this is the part I can't show you. You're going to go down or wherever to your Xbox, okay? And if you're already in uh, MW2 multiplayer, you need to go to the main menu where it has spec ops, campaign, and multiplayer. You want to back out all the way to there, and then you're going to click back on multiplayer. And then you're going to get back onto the Xbox Live, and when you're at the very first, like at the screen where it shows your name, and then create a class and all that stuff in barracks, you're going to click create a class, and you're going to wait. Now, if it doesn't glitch, with it, or if, if you send it to the game enough, um, in a couple seconds, I would say maybe um, 5 to uh, 15 seconds later, a screen should pop up saying, changes have been made on Call of Duty Elite, would you like to receive them? And then you click yes. That'll take like maybe a second or two, and then you'll have your colored classes. So I mean, it's really simple. It's really easy. Um, like this video if it helped you. Um, subscribe maybe. Why don't you look at some of my Minecraft videos? And um, 
I hope this helps you guys out a lot, uh, and I hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see you guys later.